Maverick's riveting story about Bill Gates, founder of Microsoft as an American entrepreneur. Once upon a time, in the vibrant city of Seattle, Washington, a boy named William Henry Gates III was born on October 28, 1955. Bill, as he was affectionately called, was the firstborn to a lawyer father and a mother who was deeply involved in civic affairs. In their modest home, Bill's loving parents and his two younger sisters nurtured his boundless curiosity and intellect. Little did anyone know that this bright-eyed child would one day reshape the world of computing and become one of the most transformative entrepreneurs in history. Bill's parents recognized his extraordinary talents early on and enrolled him at the prestigious Lakeside School. It was here, at the age of 13, that he stumbled upon his passion for computers. The school had recently acquired a teletype terminal connected to a mainframe computer, which allowed students to experiment with programming languages like BASIC. Bill was captivated by this new world and devoted countless hours to mastering the art of coding. He and three friends formed the Lakeside Programmers Club, a group that would spend their free time exploring the vast potential of computer technology. Their dedication led them to work for a data processing company called Computer Center Corporation, where they were tasked with finding bugs in the software. This experience ignited a fire within Bill, as he began to dream of a future where computers would be as commonplace as televisions. As Bill's love for computers continued to grow, so did his entrepreneurial spirit. At the age of 17, he and his close friend Paul Allen started a company called Traf O Data. The duo aimed to revolutionize traffic data analysis by leveraging the power of computers. While Trafo data ultimately failed, it taught Bill and Paul valuable lessons about the trials and tribulations of entrepreneurship and the importance of persistence. In 1973, Bill left Seattle to attend the prestigious Harvard University, intending to follow in his father's footsteps and study law. But destiny had other plans. The release of the MITS Altair 8800 microcomputer in 1974 captivated Bill and Paul. Seeing an opportunity, they set out to develop a version of the programming language BASIC for this new platform. Their success in this endeavor led to a fateful meeting with MITS president, who agreed to distribute their software. And thus, in 1975, Microsoft, later renamed Microsoft, was born. With a shared vision of a computer on every desk and in every home, Bill and Paul worked tirelessly to grow their fledgling company. Their hard work paid off when, in 1980, IBM approached Microsoft to develop an operating system for their new line of personal computers. Bill's astute business acumen led him to negotiate a deal that allowed Microsoft to retain the rights to the software, which would later become MS-DOS. The introduction of MS-DOS marked the beginning of Microsoft's meteoric rise. In the following years, the company launched a series of groundbreaking products, such as Microsoft Word and Microsoft Excel, that revolutionized productivity. Bill's dedication to innovation played a crucial role in the development of these products, as he often worked alongside his team, sharing ideas and writing code. But it was the release of Windows in 1985 that truly changed the game. This graphical operating system allowed users to interact with their computers using a mouse and icons, making computing accessible to millions of people. 
Bill's unwavering dedication and strategic thinking had propelled Microsoft to the forefront of the technology industry. Microsoft's journey to success was not without its challenges. The company faced numerous legal battles, including a high-profile antitrust lawsuit in the late 1990s. Bill's tenacity and ability to persevere through adversity allowed Microsoft to weather these storms and emerge stronger. The company continued to innovate, developing new technologies like the Xbox gaming console and the Windows Phone, expanding its reach into various facets of the technology landscape. As Microsoft flourished, so did Bill's wealth. But rather than hoarding his fortune, he decided to use it for the greater good. In 2000, Bill and his wife Melinda established the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, which has since grown to become one of the world's largest and most influential philanthropic organizations. With a focus on pressing global issues such as poverty, education, and healthcare, the foundation has had a profound impact on countless lives around the world. While Bill's entrepreneurial journey is filled with remarkable achievements, it is his personal growth and evolution that makes his story truly inspiring. Over the years, he transitioned from a hands-on technical leader to a visionary figurehead. In 2000, he stepped down as CEO of Microsoft, entrusting the position to his longtime friend and colleague, Steve Ballmer. Although no longer involved in day-to-day -day operations, Bill remained an integral part of Microsoft's leadership, guiding the company's strategic direction and championing its culture of innovation. In 2006, Bill announced his plans to transition out of a day-to-day -day role at Microsoft and dedicate more time to his philanthropic endeavors. This decision further demonstrated his commitment to using his wealth and influence to make a positive impact on the world. As a philanthropist, Bill has demonstrated an unwavering commitment to improving the lives of others. His tireless work through the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation has touched the lives of millions and provided hope to those in need. From eradicating diseases like polio and malaria to providing clean water and sanitation in developing countries, the Foundation has tackled some of the world's most pressing problems with steadfast determination. Bill's approach to philanthropy emphasizes the importance of innovation and collaboration. He has forged partnerships with governments, nonprofit organizations, and the private sector to amplify the impact of his foundation's efforts. He has also championed the power of data-driven decision-making, using rigorous analysis to identify the most effective strategies for tackling global challenges. In 2021, Bill and Melinda Gates announced their decision to divorce, but they remained committed to their philanthropic mission. Together, they continued to lead the foundation, ensuring that their wealth would be used to create lasting, positive change in the world. The story of Bill Gates is a powerful testament to the power of passion, hard work, and resilience. His journey from a young computer enthusiast to the founder of Microsoft, and eventually one of the world's most influential philanthropists, serves as a shining example of what can be achieved when one remains true to their dreams and is willing to take risks. Some key moments in Bill's life that illustrate his determination and ability to overcome adversity include his decision to drop out of Harvard to pursue his dream of building Microsoft. His unwavering commitment to making personal computers accessible to the masses, and his dedication to tackling global issues through philanthropy. 
As an entrepreneur, Bill never shied away from taking calculated risks and seizing opportunities. His keen sense of timing and ability to recognize potential allowed him to transform Microsoft into a global technology powerhouse. For instance, the decision to acquire the rights to the software that would become MS-DOS demonstrated his strategic thinking and foresight. The story of Bill Gates serves as an inspiration for generations of dreamers, entrepreneurs, and innovators. His extraordinary achievements, coupled with his commitment to improving the lives of others, are a testament to the power of perseverance, passion, and vision. It is a reminder that no matter the challenges we face, we can achieve remarkable success and make a lasting impact on the world if we stay true to our passions, embrace opportunities, and remain committed to creating positive change.